Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. And in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at Decula, Georgia, which is one of Gwinnett County's fastest growing uh, cities and suburban areas of the Atlanta metropolitan area. So without further ado, let's jump into the pros and cons of living in Decula, Georgia. All right, guys, if this is your first time here on the channel, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Raymond Riley, and I am a real estate broker here in Atlanta, Georgia. I have clients here in the state of Georgia, as well as other states and countries across the world to help you relocate right here to Atlanta, Georgia, uh, making it smooth, making it easy for you to understand what the procedures are, go through the process, and make it happen. So if you have any real estate concerns as it relates to buying or selling in the Atlanta metropolitan area or the entire state of Georgia, feel free Free to reach out to me all of my contact information is in the description below you can also go ahead and book a consultation I always get that wrong uh, right there oh book a consultation with me uh, directly using the link provided in the description so let's go ahead and jump into the pros and cons of living in Decula Georgia okay so before we get started in the video let me do a caveat real quick uh, as you can see we're in a, a forest <laughs> which is known as my backyard so this video is in two parts you're gonna get to see footage of Decula so don't worry about that so stay tuned watch the video throughout you're gonna get to see the downtown area of Decula and the city hall uh, but we're gonna be doing the talking portion from here talking about the pros and cons of living here as well as some of the stats of Decula Georgia so without further ado let's go ahead and jump into the video so Decula Georgia is located 37.4 miles northeast of downtown Atlanta uh, it is one of those further suburb areas of the Atlanta metropolitan area but indeed it is still within the Atlanta metropolitan area Decula Georgia is primarily in Gwinnett County Georgia which as you can see on the channel I am a Gwinnett County realtor so if you're looking to purchase or sell property in Gwinnett County, feel free to reach out to me. So the population in Decula is just shy of 7,000 residents and climate. As I said, it's one of the fastest growing small areas in Gwinnett County that you'll find. Uh, most people like the fact that you get a little bit more real estate as far as the acreage is concerned. You're a little bit further away from the hustle and bustle. So if you work from home or if you're retiring, if you want a slower pace of life, uh, but not like completely disassociated from reality, Decula, Georgia is a good place to consider. So it is on the top of many people's list uh, because of that. So it is ultimately uh, one of those areas that people are flocking to. Okay, let's go ahead and run through some quick stats real fast. So the average household income in Decula is about $82,000 with a poverty rate of about 5%. The rate of ownership in Decula is about 74% and the rate of rental is about 25%. So a large concentration of ownership in Decula. So the medium home listing price in Decula is roughly about $430,000 at this time. The nearest major interstate to Decula is Interstate 85, and the distance from the Atlanta Hartsfield Jackson International Airport is about 45.4 miles. So if you are a frequent flyer, you're gonna be a little bit ways from the airport. Um, so just kind of keep that in mind as you consider living in Decula. So let's go ahead and jump into the pros and cons section of this video where we'll talk about the good, the bad, the ugly, <laughs> so you can get a better idea of what Decula, Georgia has to offer. And before we get started, let me say this. All of my opinions are literally a baseline to your research. It should be a starting point. It should not be the end all be all. Right. Uh, if you are a resident of Decula, go ahead and chime in in the comments. Let people know about your city. Uh, validate or invalidate some of my opinions. It's up to you. This channel is truly, uh, I want equitability, right? I want everybody to have their equality to be able to say what they want to say as long as it's not hurting anyone, as long as it's not racially charged, as long as it's not political. Uh, say what you want to say about Decula, right? Let's have a conversation in the comments. All right, let's go ahead and begin with the pros of living in Decula. First pro, Gwinnett County. As I said on many of my videos, um, Decula is in Gwinnett County, Georgia, so it is within Gwinnett County Public Schools. Gwinnett County Public Schools is one of the most diverse school districts that you'll find in the entire state. It is also the largest public school system you'll find in the entire state. Over 118,000 uh, students, I was about to say residents, uh, it sounds like a little town, right? A city, uh, uh, but Gwinnett County 
is super large as it relates to a school district and they are still even with those numbers they are doing very good metrics they're having they have very good performance data in comparison to the state uh, achievement and performance numbers for uh, the CCPRI report that comes out from the Georgia Department of Education so great schools is the first pro of living in Decula. All right, pro number two is going to be a great quality of life. Uh, overall, people and residents are happy about living in Decula. So the quality of life is pretty good. Um, also, Decula, with it being a suburban area, you're not really going to get a lot of that city type of attributes that a lot of people uh, want to get away from or people that you don't want an alternative to that. So with the quality of life aspect, most of the residents in Decula are very, very happy living there. Also, Decula is one of the safest uh, cities in Gwinnett County based on crime data. You can definitely go and check out more of that. So I'll give you the crime data statistics uh, of Decula so you can investigate that a little bit further. Also here locally, uh, in certain magazine articles, I found Decula has been in the top five uh, best places to live in Georgia uh, before. So it is, as I said, quality of life is there. It's a good balance, okay? Uh, if you want to be close to stuff, uh, but not have the minutia that comes with the city life, Decula, Gwinnett County, is definitely an alternative to consider. All right, pro number three is the fact that Decula is gonna be suburban and quiet. It is very quiet living there. Um, Besides maybe the rush hour with the school times, with the school buses and people commuting back and forth to work, uh, outside of that, Decula is super quiet. Not a whole lot goes on in Decula. They are trying to make things a little bit more, I guess, um, uh, vibrant in my opinion over time, but for the most part, it's a very, very quiet area. So if you're looking for the more nature, the more serene, uh, the more away, uh, and basically everything I'm saying is the same thing in a way because I'm just giving you different perspectives to look at it but it is a very quiet uh, and convenient place with convenience uh, it is located uh, outside of um, Lawrenceville so you do still have all of that close proximity to uh, all of the shopping the entertainment that Lawrenceville has to offer so you still get that okay uh, and you also have Gwinnett County Airport which is an airport that is used chartered uh, planes uh, general aviation Aviation. If you are in the general aviation community, like myself, you should, you know, you can have your your, your plane, get your hangar, and you can live in Gwinnett County and fly out of uh, uh, the Gwinnett County Airport very conveniently. All right. So, and a lot less air traffic than uh, P Street to Cab. So, uh, nonetheless, very convenient uh, and very quiet. And the final pro on my list of Decula, living in Decula, Georgia, is the fact that there are decent diversity numbers living in uh, Decula. Um, it has been one of those places where people can thrive and be very, very polite with one another. Uh, Decula is one of those areas where you can go to the park, you can go walk around, and people will greet you. People will say hi. Uh, so it is very, very southern in its own way. Uh, and it is very, very diverse in my opinion. I'll also link the website where you can look at the diversity stats down in the description well, as well. All right, so let's go ahead and talk about the cons of living in Decula because where there is good, there is bad. Uh, so let's talk a little bit about uh, what my perspective of some of the negatives are in living in Decula. The first one is commuting into Atlanta. <laughs> uh, Decula is situated uh, further away from the interstate. So it has similar issues like Loganville that we've discussed. Uh, it is a little bit further away. So if you're commuting into Atlanta, you're going to be landlocked uh, for the most part. So I would say you want to consider what that looks like for your commute prior to actually selecting Decula, Georgia as your next place to live uh, if you're going to be commuting in and out of Atlanta every single day. Okay. And the next uh, con is gonna be that it is a sleepy town. Not a lot goes on there. If you're young, vibrant, hip, want to live the city life, Decula may not be the place for you to go. Uh, it is a very sleepy town, all right? There are not a lot of uh, night club. There aren't any nightclubs. I, I don't even know if they have a true bar in Decula. You may have to drive over to Lawrenceville for an actual traditional style bar and tavern. Um, so uh, if, you're, if you're looking for more entertainment, you know, you definitely want to be okay with commuting to get that entertainment because Decula, uh, just right in the city limits, may not be able to offer that in the way in which you may want to be offered, okay? So if that is a part of your lifestyle, uh, I definitely think you should uh, very, very much so consider 
and, and look at uh, all of those things inside of the Kula that you are gonna wanna do because there is not a lot of entertainment options when it comes to uh, 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 clubs and bars and things like that. So outside of that, if you want family time at a pizzeria or you know stuff like that, you should not have any issues with living in the Kula. Uh, but so yeah, just do your due diligence on uh, the things that you like as far as entertainment to see if the Kula is gonna have that to offer. All right, guys, we are at the end of our video. So thank you for watching it. Thank you for supporting the channel. Man, the, the growth on the channel is phenomenal. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, become a part of the YouTube family here where you can learn more about living in the Atlanta metropolitan area, the city of Atlanta. More content is coming regarding the city of Atlanta, more in-town neighborhoods. This geographical area is super large. I'm doing my best to cover it as best as I can, but I want you to understand that all of these videos are baseline. Uh, this is where you could just get your start your foundational uh, research. More content about living in the Kula is gonna be coming to the channel. I'm gonna be taking you to some different places. We're gonna be looking at some real estate options. Uh, we're gonna be talking more about the Kula on the channel. So if you're interested in the Kula, Georgia, living in the Kula, Georgia, homes for sale in the Kula, Georgia, or real estate in the Kula, Georgia, this is a YouTube channel for you. You, feel free to hit that like button and subscribe it costs you nothing and it helps out tremendously here for the channel thank you for watching also if you are looking to buy or sell real estate in Decula, Georgia, Gwinnett County, feel free to reach out to me. All of my contact information will be in the description below so you can reach out to me and I would love to assist you in uh, helping you achieve your real estate needs. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.